Hello, this is Victor. I'm here with a new channel studio update. And yeah, let's start to see what we are going to have this month of July. So first of all, I have to say that I will be on holidays out of my painting table for about more, a little bit more than two weeks. I'm mm, traveling back to my home country. So yeah, I will not be able to paint as much as I wanted. But yeah, here we have uh, what you see. I'm finalizing now the painting job on this last sister of battle. I'm doing a tutorial on her. Uh, in this tutorial, I will show you even how I do, how to create your own wash. So I will prepare tutorials and I will keep the painting, the weekly paintings. So the only thing is I will prepare them all together. So most likely on the next weekly painting. I will keep working on this miniature, I will show you how to do faces on this type of faces, especially mouths uh, that are people uh, sometimes are not doing in the right way. Okay, I will do another tutorial on how to prepare your own wash. Normally we use spray work it washes and and yeah and then I maybe I will do another one of, I don't know if I will do something about doing fire how to do these flames, uh, I will think about the third one, but I will prepare all these tutorials and I expect that you will not have interruption on your tutorials. As you can see, I also start painting the the silver tower miniatures. I start with this hero, really uh, just the first steps. I'm doing a tutorial on how I'm doing this hero. I will do tutorial for all the different miniatures on the silver tower. I will try to do that. This guy, as there are two, I will do a tutorial when I'm doing the second one. I'm just doing this guy. I will do what I call chew gum pink color. Okay, as you can see, I'm also working with I I I use some of these new bases launched by Games Workshop, and some of them I was experimenting if they can be used in Age of Sigmar, uh, especially on Silver Tower. So I'm working on that. This is what you are going to see. So uh, you you will see the starting and the painting tutorial uh, of the Silver Tower, and I will go through the Silver Tower during this summer. I want to paint all the box in one month if it's possible. Let's see. It's a little bit of challenge for me because I want to paint them to a good standard. Uh, yeah, and that's for the channel. I will keep. Yeah, I will do a review of the general handbooks. I ordered the last campaign, All Gates, uh, you will expect a review from that, and I will also review the Sylvanet. So more to come on, on, on Edge of Sigmar. And I also subscribe to a tournament the 31st of the 30 or 31st of July in the Games Workshop store. So it's going to be the first tournament with the points and I will try to participate in the campaign. So as you can see, maybe I will be a little bit more busy on on the Age of Sigma side, I expect on August to jump back to 40k. I try to to balance, but so far I'm really enjoying a lot Age of Sigma and I'm I'm really enjoying ruling the background and playing the game. So this way I maybe I'm dedicating a little bit more to Age of Sigma. And I want to paint the Silver Tower because I want to start doing games of Silver Tower and see if I can put them also in the channel to show you how to play Silver Tower. So yeah, this is what you can expect. And now let's make a look on the Facebook. As you may know, I have a Facebook um, group they created. If you want to 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 join the group, everybody is welcome. Uh, it's a place where you can share your work, I can give comments, and it's also a forum to for discuss and and to know more techniques. I will try. I try to be active. I try to. I will. Uh, yeah. So far, I'm. I'm trying to give him um, feedback on all the work presented there. And now let's make a good a look to the Facebook site. So now what I want to share with you is a little bit what we have on the Facebook group. I, I start, it's still very small, only 30 members, but everybody's invited. So if you have any friend that wants to also be uh, invited, please don't feel, uh, uh, feel free to, to ask uh, anybody or to invite anybody that you want to, to share to join and yeah I will put the link in the description of the video uh, so you can also access and ask for access I keep it as a closed group because I, I really want this to be dedicated to hobby and I want to avoid the garbage mm, messages so what we have here is 
as I say in the description, it's a place to showcase, it's a place to ask questions, it's a place to share your work and to share your techniques. So I really want here to be a forum of discussion for the hobby and anything related to this hobby. And you see, for example, for Caleb uh, Good Johnson, Goodson, sorry, from Caleb Goodson, we have he's doing a Decepticon um, theme blood uh, blood bone, and he is showing with us. Uh, the work. So here we have uh, the Colgorath with its Decepticon colors. Okay, he wants to make the skin like fluid metal. It's cool, quite a, a curious concept. Uh, you can have everything. So here we ha have another work from Caleb Goodson. This uh, Phoenix with a rider on top. Then we have Jose Figueira. Okay, here showing some of the the, the blood in the slaughter priest very nice and dripping and it's explaining here you can make questions so when you see here you can make questions for example and he's explaining that he's using a stream uh, to do you see uh, we can see the the ants sorry uh, what it was that here so you see that he's explaining that he's using um, just fishing stream to do the the blood dripping so even very easy technique so i also put some pictures of of the i also put here some pictures uh here we have the evolution so you can put pictures of the progress i put some of also the pictures that you can see in my channel so more progress for people people giving advices so i want to give this to be an open forum where everybody can share the work this was a suggestion from uh, from one of my from one of the subscribers, and I think it's a good idea. And uh, is is in, in improving the interaction here, for example. Uh, also, yeah, he's using Caleb Goodson is using the Septicon for the bad guys, and is using the uh, the Autobots for the good guys. And this is the Optimus Prime. So it's really a fun and curious concept. I, I, and then I also put pictures of the Star Trek. And here we have another uh, fan project. He's using, is doing this type of things for the, what's called this, the game um, Doom. Okay, so we see also Vince Venturella showcasing. So the really awesome job from Vince Venturella. We have to wait until the I have a very bad connection now, so the image needs time to be. I, I'm in a hotel and the connection here is really slow sometimes. So here we see really a, a masterpiece from Vince Venturella. Uh, so if you want to come here and, and share what you are doing, you are very welcome. I really want this to be an open forum of discussion. So here we see another from Juan and then we can give advices and, and give and if you see how these things are and this guy is painted with blue uh, white skin so we have some orcs with white skin and I see orcs now with white skin I have seen orcs with blue skin I have seen orcs with yellow skin so they are not limited to the green skin okay and also here from King we have so really I, I was pleased. I, I really like to see other people posting the, the work. Uh, this was not a, a fun thing to see. How? Let's see if I can. It's working. It's, it's going very slow on this. You see here, this guy is moving. It's a really. So, yeah. So please come join us here. So we have here another miniature from Jose Figueira. Okay. Yeah, uh, really fun. So you see here, he is explaining what he's doing. He's doing uh, mods for uh, for Doom. He's doing a mod for Doom. So, and he's using this thing. So yeah, if you want to join us, you are more than welcome. Please join us to this. You will find the link in the description below. And with that, I, I conclude now the studio update. And yeah. Now we can do after the studio update. We are ready to do the what's called this the 
Oh, the yeah, we can do the random selection of the winner of the prize. So now the first, the last step of the video, I'm going to generate a random number for the winner of the giveaway. Remember uh, that the beginning of June, I say that the fourth of July is finishing the the giveaway contest. Uh, you have to give a, a yeah a option for a video in in the original video. And now here I'm going to choose the winner. Uh, uh, just as a reminder, you have one entry for each for a comment. And then if you are supporter of my in Patreon, I give you an extra entry for each dollar that you pledge that you have in the pledge. So you will see that some people is more than one time because they are supporting me in in the in Patreon. I gonna want to give them this extra bonus for the support. Um, I, I never, yeah, they never know that I will do that. It's just uh, from my side that I decide to do that. Uh, and I think it's a, a way to compensate that they are supporting me also in Patreon. And as well, all the people that are supporting me by commenting and liking these videos are all in this list. Even the people that told me that they don't want to be, as I, they answer my video, I really them, uh, if they are winning, I will, I will do something for them, even if they don't want the prize. So, yeah, because I'm the owner of the channel and I can do that. So let's generate. We have from 1 to 48 all the numbers. Uh, okay, as I said, some people have repeated because they are, they, they are supporting me in Patreon. Uh, let's generate and I will do just one generation. And the number is the 47. So 47 is uh, Mikkel uh, is one of my supporters in, in Patreon. I will send you a message. Uh, and then we we align on what is the miniature that you would like to have and if you want to have it painted or not painted so that's all uh, congratulations to michael or mikkel or uh, how it's pronounced and i will drop your message and yeah please uh, thanks a lot i want to thank you everybody for the support I think have been three years really of um, amazing for me. I see my channel growing every day more and more. I'm really, 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 really happy on how all this channel is going. And I will keep pushing. I will try to put as much content as I can. As I said at the beginning of the video, this July, I will not be able to put too much content. Today, I'm in a hotel. I'm in a business trip. And I will be also in a business day tomorrow, so I will be a couple of days out of my studio and then I go to Spain, to my home country, for a couple of weeks. So, yeah, it's going to be a short month for me in terms of um, painting, but I will try to push as much as I can. And again, congratulations to Michael and thanks to everybody that is supporting my channel in any way. I really appreciate all the support that is given to my channel. And that's all for now. As usual. Thanks a lot for watching and see you again later. Bye.